Hello, hello everybody and welcome back to the Lost Archives. My name's Owen and we are playing Pokemon Violet. We're heading up towards the mountains now to Mont Montenevra, which is where we're going to take on the ghost type gym leader. This is this has to be one of my favorite villages in all of Pokemon. I think it's just so cool. We'll just see if we can get like a little bonus from eating sandwiches. Mm, yeah, we're good for produce. Let's head on up to the gym challenge and let's get this done. We're going to keep our team from before. Obviously, last session we went looking for a bishop to turn into a king's gambit. However, no dice. Bishop is too high level for us to catch right now. Hey, I heard the good news. Congrats on gym badge number six. Not even a tenth of the trainers you take on the gyms get this far, you know. But I'm not surprised that you made it. I just knew there was a reason you caught my eye. Oh, thanks. That's nice of you to say. Oh, please, I should be the one thanking you. Anyway, I bet you could use a little warming up before you take on the gym, huh? Come on, you know the drill by now. Force battle? Force battle. That's all right. Although leading with the Zoroark might be interesting. Hmm. <laughs> Let's see how this goes. Da -da -da what does that mean? Oh, well. Here's our battle court for today. Okay, hmm. Always important to check what environment your Pokemon will be battling in. Battlefield can have these teeny effects on your Pokemon's balance and stuff, you know? Anyway, sorry I sort of dragged you here, but a little pre-gym warming up should do you good. Now come on, let's have a fruitful battle. Oh, it's cool, it's like a soundstage. Alrighty. Like and rock again, except this time we are not leading with Annihilate, we're actually leading Show me the battle skills that got you six badges. Yeah, but unfortunately this is a Zoroark, not our Annihilate. Um... I'm a flicking Quackwa. That's right, Sand Attack's just gonna lower my accuracy and that's okay. Let's check out liquidation. It's gonna miss. <gasps> no! Not very effective, sorry. Let's try liquidation again. Much better. That stung, but you're not the only one who can hit hard when it counts. Mm, I don't know about that. That's the thrill of the battles. You never know what's gonna happen next. and snowing. Pormo. I will switch Pokemon because Pormo is electric fighting. Let's have a quick look. Electric fighting, which means it's going to be sad against ground, psychic, and fairy. Uh-oh. Ground, psychic, fairy. Ah, oh, looks like Zoroark's coming back out. <laughs> have to use extra sensory. Zoroark's going to look like an eye -lipe. Yeah. Extra sensory it is. Paralyzing me. It's a dick move, mate. Come on. That's right, we can power through this. Mm, that did a bit more damage than I would have liked to have seen. There we go. Sligu. Oh, I don't have my fairy Pokemon with me. Oh no. I don't think I've got anyone who can do dragon attacks either. I wasn't ready for her to fight me. Um, what else is good? Ice Dragon Fairy. Ugh, I haven't got anything like that. Oh no, we are so unprepared for this. Um, resistant against fire, water, grass, electric. <laughs> So all our starters. Um, 
Yeah, do you know what? We're just gonna have to just gonna have to sit and annihilate. Damn, I knew I should have brought Tinker Tough with me, or Tinker Ton. Okay, um Do you know what? Let's just let's just do this. Perfect. <laughs> it's the only way. Karate. Yes, I will definitely switch. Infueno. Trading attacks on the brink of winning or losing gives me chills. Let's see who gets the win. It's going to be me. You haven't made any of my Pokemon faint yet. Alright, definitely going to do a Terrestrialized Torch Song. Here comes the fun part. Time to make this terror orb shine. I like the way she charges up the terror orb. It's kind of cool, actually. All right, here we go. Moment of truth. Hopefully we've got faster movement speed. Right. Get ready. This move is going to hit with the force of all my training. Hopefully we're first though. No! Ah oh, well. We're just fire type now, so that's going to do not much at all. Not very effective. That's a shame. Beautiful. That's what I like to see. We're ready for the ghost gym. <laughs> Probably. <gasps> ah. I knew I was right to believe in you. 15,000, that's not a bad little haul. I love the idea of the amulet coin. Like, how does it actually work? Like, are you just walking in and being like, I oh, have to pay me double. I got this little amulet. <laughs> that's an L for me. Man, you've gotten so good. I think that should be enough of a warm up. You and your Pokemon should be all set now. Here, take these as thanks for the battle. Oh, Max Potions, thank you. Just two gyms remaining, then that'll... Then all that'll be left is to try it out to be a champion. Give it all you've got. Now let's get you back to the gym lobby. Um, but I might want to heal my Pokemon at a Pokemon Center. I might want to heal my Pokemon. <laughs> are my Pokemon all heals? Oh, they are all heals. Ah, well, let's do the gym challenge. Welcome to the gym. Register as a challenger. Ooh, Dreepy. Mm, maybe we should bring a fairy type Pokemon with us. That's right, you're the opening act. Your job is to get up on stage, show us some dead fierce Pokemon battles and get the crowd excited before the gym leader begins. Okay. Get out there and have fun. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we might bring, might bring our Tinkerton with us actually. Hmm. Hmm, who should I leave behind? Quackwa. Fighting and water are not going to be helpful, but having two dark type moves is going to be helpful. All right, we're ready. Let's go outside and do this. Alrighty, let's have a look. Oh, wow. <laughs> it's the same stage we we're at before. Okay. Hey, you. Opening act. Yo, trainer. You the one performing the opening act today? My name's MC Sledge. This is the stage right here. So here's the deal, we're gonna have you do some double battles. That's where you have two Pokemon fight on each side. That'll let you sledge up double the opponents and get the audience twice as excited. The venue will be so hot it'll melt the mountain ever snow. Once you get the audience worked up and ready to go, that'll be the cue for our leader to take the stage. That's how you pass out gym test, yo. Your opening app begins as soon as you get up on the stage. There'll be no backing down until you win three times in a row, so make sure you're ready. You good on the deets for the opening act in our gym test? Ready to sledge them up? Uh, I'm not ready yet. I just want to change my Pokemon around. <laughs> I feel you. Opening for RAM is no easy task. Make sure you're ready to go before we start. All right. Um, 
to be honest. Ghost type, ghost type. What do we decide again about the ghost type Pokemon? I'm trying to remember why. Hmm, let me have a quick look. Ready, let's go. Sweet, just play it by ear, you do great. Head up onto the stage. <sighs> Gym test, warm up the audience for Rhymes concert. Oh my god, there's like tombstones out the front. <laughs> What's up, Montenebra? Today's opening act will be the three back-to-back -back double battles by our challenger here. Oh, wait. And the first of their three opponents will be a young performer who makes it look like a breeze. Oh my god, it's a tiny child. The one, the only, Taz. Double battles, that means one plus one, right? Can you do math? Oh my god. They've literally sent a child. Okay, let's do this. Shuppet and Graveyard. All right, we're gonna get rid of Graveyard first because I think he's fire dark. Let's do... Hmm, I think we'll do a foul play, get rid of Graveyard. Do a Night Slash, get rid of Graveyard. Ah, might be that we only needed to do one of those. <laughs> This is good music. This is like the music I actually genuinely listen to. Brilliant. Oh, is that him knocked out completely? One plus one is two, right? Right? Ooh, now the lights turn on. Wait, it's another child. Oh, there's some more people. Okay. The audience cheering got a little louder. <gasps> the Munton of stage has all the latest tech. The more excited the audience gets, the more the stage will light up. Keep on sledging, you got this. And our challenger's next opponent will be a musician with a bit of a unique style. It's Lenny. Oh, okay. Oh god, this looks like a Dragon Ball Z character. Strong compliments, weak harmony of two Pokemon battling in unison. <laughs> she looks like a smoker. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what that was. I'm sorry. Quanta and Ms. Drevis. Okay. Well, I think we just carry on, hey? Brilliant. That was super easy. We've got this. Oh, look, her hair's like clipping through her face. Oh, look at that. Oh, Pokemon. Just under her eye, look. That's just sad, man. That's just sad. <laughs> oh, dearie me. The audience is really getting excited. You open an axe, turn the cheering and the stage lighting up to 11. What a surprise from our new challenger. Who'd have thought they'd sledge it up this much? Next is your last opponent. And it's none other than me, MC Sledge. Sledge, 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 Sledge. Sledge. 
being an MC in my only f -f forty. I can battle too. I sledge you up real good in a double ba -ba -ba battle. I'm assuming that's what he sounds like. All right, let's go MC Sledge. Sableye and Driftblim. I think we're just going to do the classic combo. Oh, this is so overpowered. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, I forgot about Aftermath. Hmm, not all the way with Sableye. Not very effective. Because it's Zoroark. <laughs> nice move choice. He's really sledging up MC Sledge. Ah, oh, because they're cheering me on. Not bad. It's over. I like Sableye. It's a cool Pokemon. Gengar wants to learn Dark Pulse. Yes, Gengar. Yes, Gengar. Um, get rid of Nightshade. Later on, it's useful. So we'll change it up when he's like high enough level. It was you who sledged me up. Ooh. Nice. The audience excitement has reached a fever pitch. Whoa, awesome. That was a great battle. Oh wait, no, these are the audience. How oh, lucky, that was a rare sight, woo! Thank you, Owen. Congratulations, you passed the gym test. Give him a round of applause, everybody. That was easy. I think we're gonna have Rhyme sound like a very like husky rock star. I feel a scary good sense of unity in the crowd. Perfecto, we're ready for the main event. Come on, everybody, say it with me. This is what you've all been waiting for. Give it up for the MC of RIP, Rhyme. I was kind of hoping it was just him, like. Oh shit, man. Oh my god. <laughs> what is she gonna sound like? What's all this noise I'm hearing? This crowd's so loud it could wake the dead. I reckon she's got like a soul vibe. Let me tell you what I wanna hear. Y'all feeling good? Yeah, we're feeling good, Ram. Woo! Thanks for the killer opener, baby. Now I get this started for real. Congrats on the gym test. That was sick, yo. Thanks. Give us a minute for some ramp time, you feel me? Go ahead and tell the lovely staff you passed. Oh, okay. All right. Okay. We'll go heal. I poke one at the gym too, I think. Unless I've already healed them up. Let's have a quick look. Already healed up? No. Maybe we'll go to the gym first. Just so we don't get thrown into a battle that we're not 100% prepared for. <laughs> just, we'll just pop by the gym now. Wait, I didn't go back in. What? Ugh. Nintendo. Come on, Nintendo. There we go. Oops. See if we can get all the way there without actually landing on the ground. Ah, oh, brilliant. <laughs> I like to have little fun games with myself. Alright, we're ready, baby. I reckon Gengar's gonna be a solid choice, actually. Let's head on up. Alright, we're ready now. Let's do this. 
Princess Paper. Gym test cleared, well done. Yeah, I'm ready to challenge Rhyme. Let's do this. I'm not giving her any opening acts. Like literally, if she's doing a song, <laughs> I just walk up. Hey, I'm ready to fight now. Come on, baby. Just literally force her to come out and fight me. Yo, yo. It sounds like there might be a rap battle going on over at the stage. Oh my God. This is my time, this is my day, you're not gonna stand in my way, listen up rhyme, your reign ends here, you're gonna get rung up by this pro cashier. <laughs> Amazing. Boom, boom, boom. Amazing. Alright, hang on. Pro cashier, what I'm about to check out, must have got your rams on a deep discount. Please, you think you can step up to my game? Fool, I got ram right there in my name. I'm a spectre from which there is no protector, and victory unto me you will render when the crowd sees you as a mere pretender. You wanna end my reign? Yeah, keep dreaming. Buy a book of rams, kid, and start reading. I'm done, you won. My rams totally whiffed, but I'll be back maybe after my next shift. Hold up, where you going? That's all you got? After my next shift, seriously? Bows over jokes, come on. That was over way too fast. It gets boring wearing the crowd. No one wants to be a fight to keep it. Hey, my opener's back. You here for a rap battle or a gym battle? I'm here for a rap battle. <laughs> ha, you got jokes. We both know why you're really here. No, I want to do the rap battle. Oh, okay, you were captivated. Captivated by the show I put on, huh? I rap what's in my soul, baby. Weaving words into a symphony of poetry. Don't try it with me. You won't last one round. I'm like a sable lamb. I mean, look, I'll knock you down. That's not, that's not what I mean, look, does. Like that, you feel me? Yeah, I feel you. Ha! Huh. Well, let's get to it. You're a Pokemon trainer, so battle me and show me who you are. My music's not all the types of charts. My skills with go types are the best around. I said goat types. I do mean ghost types. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Lest you forget it, the name's Rhyme and I'm known as MC of RIP. Dead or alive, let's make this a vibe. I like our eyes, man. They're cool as. Gym leader Ram. Oh, it's a double battle. Right, well, we're ready for that. We don't mess around in Montenegro. On my stage, we double battle. Don't let it scare you. I'm not scared. I've got the ultimate technique. <laughs> I just do the double, <laughs> the double night slash. Show us an awesome battle, right? And you too, rando kid. Fuck you guys. I do what I want. <gasps> Shadow sneak. Surprise. I'm not a ghost type. <laughs> What? Wait, it's not a Mimikyu? Oh, the Disguise, that's right. Oh, it's gone now. Oh no, it's not gone now. Hmm. Throw a bit of rap right back at him, Ram, Ram, Ram. <laughs> hmm. Why are they cheering Rhyme? I did way better that round. Oh shit. All right, um, do you reckon they've got any items? Probably not. All right, let's do a foul play on that Bennett. Let's get rid of it. And I'll do a Night Slash on this Mimikyu. Yeah, Mimikyu's gone. And let's get rid of this Bennett, hey? Beautiful. That's what I like to see. Toxtricity. Ooh, I don't have a good Toxtricity counter with me. Houndstone. Ooh, wow, that's creepy, man. Nice, he totally nailed that Pokemon's weakness without batting an eye. <gasps> Give me a cheer. Oh, perfect. Give me attack and special attack. That's what I want. I didn't realize Toxtricity was dark type. Oh, that's the um, that's the Pokemon she's going to do um, Terra type on. So we want to just wail on the Houndstone and get rid of it. Kick back, relax, and enjoy this track. Turn it up for a grave rattling good time. Oh shit! Oh my god! 
Oh, they're all houndstone. That makes sense. I thought they were like gravestones, but I mean, technically they are. Oh, look at the one on top, the little graveyard on top. Oh, oh he's doing a cool dance. When I'm on the mark, even the dead rise up. DJ G Rave over there, sure feeling it. Wait, the dog's called DJ G Rave? It's pretty cute. All right, which one's she? It's Toxtricity, surely, yeah. Ghost type Toxtricity. So it's poison lightning normally. Okay. Yeah, let's knock that Houndstone out and then this will be perfect. I'm not even um, terror, terror, terror typing, terraforming, terror crystalling, terrestrializing <laughs> for this one. Discharge, that's a double. Ooh, paralyzing my Zoroark, eh? <gasps> Ghost Rastalization's the bomb, you're really killing it, Rhyme! No, 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 don't do that. Give me the love. Yeah. Oh, no, defense. Ah, oh, it doesn't matter, I've still got to take it out this turn. Whoa, okay. Um, did they just raise all its stats? All right. Oops. Oh, it doesn't matter. It's over. And I didn't even terrestrialize. <laughs> Brilliant. That's how it's done. Giving up the ghost not really my style. I'll let you have this one though, baby. Well, I mean, it's not like you let me have it. I won. <laughs> huh, great battle, chilling and thrilling. You got spirit, kid. You and my gym badge, all right? How about a VIP pass for my next show, too? Yeah, right. Oh, that's cool. Oh, her hair's like a hand. I didn't even notice that before. That's really cool. That's kind of spooky. Oh, yeah, it is too. Look at that. That's so funny. I didn't even notice it. With seven gym badges, it'll be easy to catch Pokemon up to level 55, and they'll listen to what you have to say too, sugar. I'm feeling so good, I think I'm also going to let you have this. Shadow Ball. Nice. I like Shadow Ball. Nice. Nice. Too bad it's over. It can be back to my stage sometime. Maybe next time we rap battle instead. Who knows? I'm sure you got some scary good adventures ahead. Adventures ahead. I'll be cheering for you. Later. Later. <laughs> nice. Oh, we can go catch a Pawniard now. Wait. No, not Pawniard. Bishop. Oh, no. I can't remember what Rika sounds like. Was Rika German? All right. Rika's going to be German now. Or maybe Rika was Swedish or French. I think she was French. Hey, hey, Rika, yeah, at your service. These gyms really aren't giving you much trouble, are they? Rika, Rika. Ah, huh? all right, you two haven't met before, have you? This young man is Owen. He's so good with Pokemon, even La Primera's taken an interest in him. <gasps> wow. But, but I think the Pokemon on Team Poppy are really strong too. Like, really strong. Which one of you is stronger, do you think? Well, um... I'm one of the Elite Four, so I'm more amazing. Wait, what? The child? <laughs> now, aren't you just adorable? Ador adorable. I know it's hard to believe, but this tiny little one is indeed one of the Elite Four. Yeah, I am. I hope I get to show you my little Pokemon soon, mister. So hurry up and come to the Pokemon League. It's where, um, it's the pinnacle. It's where the pinnacle of Pokemon battling happens. See you there. Hey, uh, hey, what's up? Well, you keep up the good work. You had the kid. She's waiting for you. Wait, that was German at the end there. Ah, whatever. <laughs> Wait up, Bobby. Don't leave your pal Rika behind. I like that you kind of get to like meet the Elite Four during your adventure as you go through. That's kind of cool, right? Like they've not done that in other Pokemon games as far as I remember. I know in Sword Shield they had the champion. Was it Leon? Yeah, the champion Leon would like travel around and you'd see Leon loads, but... Ooh, new classes. We're gonna do the classes, but nah, we're actually gonna go get a Bishop.
Okay. Excuse me. Let's. Okay. Let's put. Let's put Zoroark away. We'll take back. We'll put this Gengar back in a box, hey? Because he's only. We only brought him with us because we couldn't control the other Gengar, but now we can. Um, and do we want to keep Annihilate on our journeys? Nah. Swap Annihilate out for this bad boy. Um, yeah, I reckon that's a pretty good team we got there. Alrighty. To the Bamboo Forest. Time to catch a Bishop and turn it into a King's Gambit. Alright. Now we did see a few bishop around here last time. We're gonna use quick balls, so I don't actually have to catch it. Um, there's one right there, and that's probably gonna be one of the ones that has. Come on. All right, fine. <laughs> Let's just do this, eh? So we wanna have the one that has the leader's crest, I believe it's called. Where's our quick balls? Got 65 of them. <laughs> Do you reckon that'll be enough? Shit. Probably water type is not the best one to have here, so let's do let's just do a mega kick. It won't take him out, I don't think. Well, if he dodges it, certainly won't. Maybe not then, it's gonna do like 75. Liquidation, 85. Maybe let's do a liquidation, because we know it won't take him out, so. Yeah, perfect, not very effective as well, I guess. Mm, it's not gonna be very effective. All right, well, since liquidation is an 85 and it didn't do a huge amount, let's try a fighting. I don't think fighting's gonna do much against bug steel. Oh, it's super effective, okay, no, I was wrong. Um, all right, well, we, we can probably catch him now. Go back to Ultra Balls, hey? I guess I could use a Net Ball. That's for Bug-type Pokemon, right? Except he's not. He's Dark Steel, I think. That won't do too much, because... Oh, that's cool. All right, let's try another Ultra Ball. Not much else I can do. I didn't bring um, Gallade with me, which was actually a massive oversight, because I could have done False Swipe and Hypnosis. Yeah, I should have brought Gallade. Yeah. All right, who's our weakest Pokemon that's with us now? Who could do a low? Yeah, sorry, Quackwa. I know, I'm sorry, buddy. Yeah, still gonna choose next Pokemon. Um, probably Knuckle Stacks our slowest. Slowest is our weakest Pokemon. Um, Salt Q is not a good idea. Mudshot. It's pretty low power. I don't think it's going to be enough to. I don't think it's be enough to knock him out. Let's find out, hey. Perfect. No, that's great. Probably even do one more, but we'll try an Ultra Ball first. Yep. Come on. Yes. Yes. Fantastic. Ah, oh, brilliant. Now we just need to. Um, use it to defeat three other bishops that have the um, leader's crest, which should be very easy to do. We'll do anything to win. Bishop mercilessly cuts its opponents to pieces with the sharp blades covering its body. We'll do anything to win. Uh, ye ah, do I want to give Bishop a nickname? I reckon so. I think we're going to call him Ronan. Oh, no. Um, oh. Can I change his name? <laughs> I forgot to delete the bishop bit. <laughs> Alright, well, let's get rid of Knuckle Stack. Oh, that's pretty funny. I hope I can change his name again now. Oh, that's really, really... Oh, no. Come on. Just get out of here, man. Just get out of here. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Alright, can we change his name? Oh god, that's embarrassing. Oh, he does have the... Okay, great. Check summary. Can I rename him? 
change nickname. Oh, thank God. <laughs> that's pretty funny. I have to delete it all, do I? All right. Oh, that tickles me. <laughs> that's really funny. That's what happens when you don't look at what you're doing. All right. Yeah, leader's crest. Um, he can he can keep a hold of that. That's absolutely fine with me. Oh my goodness, it's time. We're here. <laughs> Yay. So, I got it wrong. You don't have to defeat three that are holding it. You have to hold three and defeat three. Wait, you have to hold hold the leader's crest and defeat three. We did it. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it looks so good. Though it commands a massive army in battle, it's not skilled at devising complex strategies. It just uses brute strength to keep pushing. We got it. Got our King's Gambit. Amazing. All right, well, there we go. We did it. Kowtow Cleave. Yeah, probably. What does that do? Use slashes at the target after cow after kotoing Kowtow to make the target let down its guard. This attack never misses. Ooh. I'll probably get rid of Slash then. Although it does have a heightened chance of only a critical hit, as does Night Slash. Hmm. I definitely want to keep Brick Break. I want to keep Night Slash. I might... I might lose Slash. It's a normal type move. I don't really care much about normal type moves, to be honest. Perfect. Ah, oh, we did it. We did it! Should we see him in action? Let's see him out. Look, he's tiny. See? He's super small. Should we do should we see what Kowtow Cleave looks like? Here we go, we'll get to him now on this poignard. Alright, awesome, here we go. So he's actually sitting on his own hair. So let's do. Just use his own head. It looks like he's bowing, but he like then cuts down with his head. That's pretty cool. Uh, what does it look like when he does brick break? Ah, yeah, fair enough. Cool, we did it. Awesome. All right, now we've got a really powerful, uh, <laughs> really powerful actually, level fifty-eight. Jesus, a really powerful dark steel type Pokemon. We are ready for any of the final gyms. So. I think let's head on up here. Let's head on up here. Let's head over and do that right away.